Okay, I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour right here on Illuminati Radio. I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I drop this breaking news. Hit that like button if you're enjoying this content. And um, this is a special request video. This is a paid video, you know what I'm saying, from, uh, I must say, anonymous donor. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't know if he want me to put his name out there. So, anonymous donor, you know what I'm saying? This one's for you, Charleston White. If you guys have any reports or any videos that you want me to report on or do, it's a little small donation of $5. The donation link is, the cash app link is in the description box below. All right. Charleston White. It seems to be, you know what I'm saying? I did my little research on him. Little research. This is my first time hearing about him, but you know what I'm saying? Before I did this video, I did my little research, and I said, okay. He got a little little bit of a platform, but I see why they allowing him to have a platform. Because he don't know nothing. Now, I'm not bashing him. I'm not bashing him. Because I've seen a whole lot of other people bashing him on social media. So I'm not bashing him by a long shot. Actually, I'm giving him props. He got a little bit of a platform. Showing up do. And guess what? The reason why he got a little bit of a platform, because he don't know shit. And I'm not bashing him, people. Like I said, I'm not bashing him. He don't know shit. And that's why the elites allow him to have a platform like he got. Because he don't know shit. Can you imagine if he knew something? Can you imagine if he preached the way I preached? Can you imagine if he, you know what I'm saying, ex knew anything about the way these celebrities passed his soul to the fire of the mullah? Can you imagine if he knew that, and every time he do his news reports, he exposed that. Can you imagine? Can you imagine who he will be teaching? Can you imagine if he knew the scriptures and how to interpret to interpret these prophecies according to scripture? Can you imagine if he knew this? Can you imagine if he knew who he was? Can you imagine? then he can apply the exposing of the Illuminati and as well as the exposing and revealing of the prophecies and he put them together and he give you that. Can you imagine how many people who would be educated and who would be fulfilled? Can you imagine? But being that you are old, and I'm not getting on you because you old. Hell, I'm old. You know what I'm saying? Shit. I'm old too. So ain't nothing. I'm not getting on you because you're old. You know what I'm saying? Us old folks, we need to stick together because the young folks got us, you know what I'm saying, doing whatever. But anyway. Number one, you're old. And number one, they at least look at you as you're old and you just, you know what I'm saying, getting on live just talking shit. Which that's what you're doing. Mr. Charleston White. You just get on live and you're just talking shit. The, the elites don't deem you as a threat when you just get on live and you're just talking shit. That's why you got your platform like you do. You know what I'm saying? And guess what? In due time, the elites may come to him and knock at his door and give him an opportunity to be much bigger and organize this day. Now you can tell he don't know shit because it's the, the way he goes live. He goes live in any type of environment. 
sitting in his car talking shit. You know what I'm saying? Smoking cigarettes and doing all sorts. Just talking shit. We ain't got time to be talking shit. We living in a day and age where we got to talk shit and educate. It's okay if you talk shit, but what are you teaching? What are you leading the people to? You got all of those people following you, but what are you leading the people to? Nuwabian? Are you leading people to that Nuwabian shit? Are you leading people to Yahweh? Are you leading people to five percenters? Are you leading people to the Christian church? What are you leading the people to? You know what I'm saying? The Bible says the harvest is plenty, but the workers are few. You are given that platform, but what are you doing with it? You know what I'm saying? Mr. Charleston White, I got nothing against you, brother. Nothing against you. But just rethink about the platform you got, Mr. Charleston White. And just understand that if you got the platform, try doing what I'm doing. And I guarantee you, <laughs> you're going to experience a whole lot of problems. So I think you better stick to doing what you continue to do. Can stick to doing what you always do, what you do best. Because the elite's like that, because you're not a threat. You know what I'm saying? You just, you know what I'm saying? I guess it's, you know what I'm saying, old man's therapy. It's therapy for your old ass. You know what I'm saying? I guess that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's therapy when you see the news. You know what I'm saying? You want to, got something to say, so you go live and talk about it. But understand this. We as old people, we have to teach the youth. We got to teach the people, you know what I'm saying? Not further, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? If, uh, they say, say for instance, this DMX thing. I seen a video where you said something about DMX and you, was, and then I seen somebody else made a video getting at you about you saying what you said about DMX. Now, if you, said that about DMX and then explain to him, explain to the people why shouldn't you pray for DMX. Like, I'm going to say like this. I say, why is people praying for DMX? We shouldn't pray for DMX because when you pass your soul through the fire of Moloch, there's your prayers, the Bible says in the book of Deuteronomy, he who turns his foot from hearing this law, even your prayers is an abomination. See, that's the scripture. He who turns his foot from hearing this law, even his prayers is abomination. See, when you come up and you make an accusation or you, you make a statement, you got to be able to prove that statement. See, that's what's great about me. When I make it a statement, I prove that statement. You know what I'm saying? He who turns his foot from hearing this law, even his prayers is abomination. So every last one of you all who say the law is done away with, or every one of you all who say that you're a Christian and don't do this law, even your prayers will be an abomination. See how easy that was to edify that? That's how we got to teach so it's, your platform is good, but what are you doing? Where are you leading the people to? Are you just a humorist, you know what I'm saying? You're just making them laugh? After the laughter is finished, what have you taught them? You see what I'm saying? I hope this has been edified. I hope this video has been edified to you, donor, who donated this $5 for this video. You know what I'm saying? I did the best I can. And when I seen the Charleston White video, I said, okay, boom, blah, 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 blah. But anyway, this has been a paid, you know what I'm saying, sponsored video to the anonymous donor. You know what I'm saying? If you have a video or um, request, news report you want me to do, just send a $5 donation. The Cash App link is in the description box below.
I want to thank you all for tuning in and logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour. Right here on Illuminati Radio, I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this breaking news on you. Hit that like button if you're enjoying this content. Also, don't forget people, you know what I'm saying, if you want to join my exclusive Facebook Messenger group, you can do so by sending me a friend request to my Facebook page. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.